Best exercises from Cindy Crawford that will transform your body in 10 minutes a day. Cindy Crawford's legendary 10 minute workout. A powerful routine that's simple, effective, and requires no special equipment. Whether you're new to fitness or looking to shake up your routine, this is the perfect workout to tone your entire body in just 10 minutes a day. Let's jump right in. Before we get started with the exercises, it's important to talk about the warm-up. Warming up is crucial to prepare your muscles, enhance your performance, and reduce the risk of injury. So let's spend a couple of minutes getting our bodies ready. All right, we're starting with a light jog in place. This gets your heart rate up and starts to loosen up those muscles. Next, let's do some arm circles, forward and backward, to warm up our shoulders. And finally, let's stretch out those legs with some dynamic lunges. Remember, warming up isn't just a formality. It's a vital part of ensuring you get the most out of your workout. Now that we're all warmed up, let's get into the real deal. First up, we've got squats. Squats are a powerhouse move that targets your glutes, quads, and calves, while also engaging your core for stability. Start with your feet shoulder width apart. Keep your chest up and lower your body as if you're sitting back into a chair. Push through your heels to return to the starting position. This move is fantastic for building lower body strength and toning your legs. Aim for 15 to 20 reps. And remember, if you're just starting out, don't worry about going too deep. Focus on maintaining good form and gradually increasing your range of motion. Next, we've got lunges. Lunges are another lower body favorite that not only works your glutes and quads, but also challenges your balance and coordination. Start by stepping one foot forward, lowering your hips until both knees are at a 90 degree angle. Then push off your front foot to return to the starting position and switch legs. Let's go over 10 to 12 reps on each leg. This move is great because it also engages your core, keeping you steady and helping to improve your overall stability. If you want to take it up a notch, you can add a pulse at the bottom of each lunge. All right, time to target the upper body with some push-ups. Push-ups are a classic exercise that works your chest, shoulders, triceps, and core. Start in a plank position with your hands slightly wider than shoulder width apart. Lower your body until your chest almost touches the floor, then push back up to the starting position. We're aiming for 10 to 15 reps here. Remember, it's crucial to keep your body in a straight line from head to heels, no sagging hips. If full push-ups are too challenging, drop to your knees and perform modified push-ups. The key is to maintain good form. Now, let's shift our focus to the core with some crunches. Crunches are excellent for strengthening your abdominal muscles and improving your core stability. Lie on your back with your knees bent and feet flat on the floor. Place your hands behind your head, elbows wide, and lift your upper body towards your knees. Go for 15 to 20 reps. Keep your movements controlled and avoid pulling on your neck. Let your abs do the work. This exercise not only helps with toning, but also plays a role in improving your posture and reducing lower back pain. Up next, we have the plank. The plank is a full body exercise that primarily targets your core, but also works your shoulders, back, and legs. Get into a forearm plank position with your body in a straight line. Hold this position for 30 to 60 seconds. The plank is fantastic for building core strength and endurance. It's one of those exercises that really pays off in all areas of fitness. Whether you're lifting weights, running, or just going about your day-to-day -day activities. Now, let's pick up the pace with mountain climbers. This exercise combines cardio with core strengthening, giving you a full body workout. Start in a plank position and bring one knee towards your chest, then switch legs quickly, as if you're running in place. We'll do this for about 30 seconds. Mountain climbers are great for burning calories and improving your cardiovascular fitness. Plus, they really fire up your core, helping you build that strong midsection we all strive for. Let's take it back to the lower body with glute bridges. This exercise is excellent for targeting your glutes and hamstrings while also engaging your core. Lie on your back with your knees bent and feet flat on the floor. Lift your hips towards the ceiling, squeezing your glutes at the top and then lower back down. 
Aim for 15 to 20 reps. Glute bridges are not only great for toning your backside, but also for improving your lower back strength. They're perfect for anyone who spends a lot of time sitting, as they help counteract the effects of prolonged sitting on the hips and lower back. Now, let's work on those arms with tricep dips. This exercise targets the triceps, the muscles at the back of your arms. All you need is a sturdy chair or bench. Place your hands on the edge of the chair, fingers pointing forward, and extend your legs out in front of you. Lower your body by bending your elbows, and then push back up. Let's go for 10 to 15 reps. Tricep dips are fantastic for sculpting your arms and improving upper body strength. Keep your movements controlled and focus on using your triceps to lift your body. Last but not least, we have bicycle crunches, a great way to finish off our workout with some serious core work. Lie on your back with your hands behind your head. Lift your legs off the ground and bring one knee towards your chest while twisting your opposite elbow towards that knee. Then switch sides like you're pedaling a bicycle. Aim for 15 to 20 reps on each side. Bicycle crunches are perfect for targeting those hard to reach obliques, helping you sculpt a well-defined waistline. Keep the movement steady and controlled, focusing on the contraction of your abs with each twist. And that's it. In just 10 minutes, you've worked every major muscle group, boosting your strength, tone, and overall fitness. Remember, consistency is key. Doing this workout regularly will lead to amazing results over time. Plus, the best part is, you don't need any fancy equipment, just your body and a little bit of space. Keep up the great work, and I'll see you in the next video.